All right, legends, welcome back. In this video, we're gonna talk about title tag strategy. What do we put in this part of our videos to make our video the most SEO friendly? See, YouTube videos have the same SEO attributes as websites, including title, description, and keywords down here. But title is by far the most important. Description and keywords play bigger factors, but it's gonna, the search result's gonna read the title before it reads everything else. So now first things first, have a title that's relative to the video you made. Don't have a video of your cat and then title your video Eminem's newest hits or Rihanna bikini in a bikini at the beach or something. People will thumbs down it, not subscribe and probably never come back to your channel. Your channel and video have zero credibility. Second, there's a lot of competition out there. See, a lot of people are making the same video criteria. For example, I just did a video tutorial series on QuickBooks and GoPro Studio, the video editing software. We'll look at GoPro Studio as an example. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull up a new browser and I'll clean my cache. Let's go to YouTube. So I wanted my video to show up number one for Go, come on, what is this? Go Pro Studio Tutorial. And where am I? I'm down, okay, so here's all the ads. Disregard those. Here's the organic searches. There's one, two, three Village Park Source. My playlist shows up, and then my number one video shows up. I'm like seventh down here. So I couldn't get that number one spot. So instead of titling my video GoPro Studio Tutorials, I had to be a little bit more specific. Um, where's my video? I had to be a little bit more specific. The more specific you are, the higher you will show up in the search results. And the broader you are, the lower you'll be at, at the search results. The lower you'll be at the totem bowl, getting a lot less views. So instead of me doing um, Go Pro Studio Tutorial. How do you spell tutorial? Just like that. I didn't have success with that. So I had to add a couple other keywords in here. I had to add words like intro. You can add intro or keep in mind you're probably not doing a video on GoPro tutorials, but something like for beginners. Um, I also threw in the year 2005, since I know most people don't want to watch outdated tutorials from 2013. I should probably change the title and even add the software version number to the title. All in all is you just want to be a little bit more specific and creative if you want your videos to get more exposure. If you're going for a video, if you're doing a video and you want the number one search for a super broad search like how to cook a steak, you're probably getting millions of views killing it on YouTube. But if you want to do a steak video and you're showing up on page eight of the search results, tweak it a little bit, like change it to how to cook a steak outside or how to cook a steak in two minutes or just something that's a little bit more creative. If there's a ton of competition. So good luck with this guys play around with it and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Keep in mind, use words like, intro or for beginners or how to or put the year in or three minutes or how quick you can put it together people want to see these videos in the least amount of time all right guys good luck with this hopefully it made sense and uh, i'll see you in the next video